Confidence is probably the number one character trait that you need to succeed in business. In fact, without it, it doesn't make a difference how many books you read or how many of the trainings that you go to, you will quickly lose anything that you gain unless you have confidence. I mean, have you ever seen this happen where you have a competitor or a friend in business who's doing much better than you, but you know so much more than they know? But the truth is that their success has more to do with their confidence than their skill. Hell, the world is full of very, very smart people, very skilled people who don't have the confidence to do what it takes to reach the goals that you have, and that's okay, because not everybody has the same goals. I mean, I look to people with an abundance of skills to hire because I want them on my team, but they will never be on our leadership team. They may become highly praised team members, but if they lack the confidence to hit big targets, then they'll be happier and our company will be much stronger when they're part of a group of employees responsible for a target. Instead of having a leadership role where they need to set and be held accountable hitting those targets themselves. Because confidence separates you from your competition and it separates leaders on your team from those team members who are best at supporting leaders, right? And confidence can be trained, but most people don't know how to do that in business. Now, I'm gonna detail how we do this inside of my companies and what we look for in team members because if you could be confident in one area of your life, then you can be confident in anything that you do. And bear with me for a second because I know that sounds weird, but let's say, for example, that you're not confident when you're hosting team meetings because most people aren't when they first start. What most people think is that in order to become confident, they need to learn how to run team meetings and then they need to run a bunch of team meetings. Then eventually they think they're going to become confident at it. And although that works sometimes, you could completely fuck up your company while you're doing that. To build confidence in any area like running team meetings, you need need to build up your overall self-confidence. Let me give you an example from my life. I have a friend who's super competitive and maybe once or twice a year we'll go away together and we'll fly planes or we'll race cars or we'll golf or we'll do something else kind of competitive. And this guy does great every single time, even when we do things that he's never done before. I remember the very first time that we flew planes together. At the time, I had over 100 hours up flying small planes and he had never flown, plus he was afraid of heights. Now, he had a flight instructor with him in the plane, and at the end of the day, that instructor couldn't believe that he had never flown planes before because he has so much confidence in himself that even being afraid of heights, he was still good at it. As entrepreneurs, we don't have the luxury of learning everything that we need to know about business first and then practicing it until we become confident and then killing it. We don't have it, right? Yo, you need to trust in yourself. You need to know what needs to be done to grow your company, then take the actions necessary to reach your targets with confidence. Remember how fucking great you are. Then do the things that need to be done with that confidence confidence. You have things in your life, I promise you, that you're very, very good at. And because you're very good at them, you're very confident when you do them. And the more you do them, the more confidence you will have in yourself. And what most people don't get is that slowly that confidence spills over into other areas of your life. And I'm certainly not saying that you could be really confident when you're playing mini golf and then run a billion dollar a year company, but definitely the more you do things with confidence, the more you will do everything in your life with confidence.